The pressure is on, and opening game nerves can often take hold. Match day one for these two nations here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. Who will be first to make their mark on the group? Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And today, it's the opening game in this particular group at the Euros. It's Serbia against England. Well, these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so important they are consistent throughout the group stages if they want to progress further in the tournament. Should be tense, Derek. And the Serbia starting 11. Dusan Tadic plays with Sergei Milinkovic Savic in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Kyle Walker plays with Kieran Trippier as fullbacks. Phil Foden plays with Bukayo Saka on the flanks. And the main striker today is Harry Kane. Now moving the ball impressively here. Making progress. Rice. Just the challenge that was required. Mitrovic. On to Milinkovic Savic. Cutting it back. Determined defending. Well, last time out at the Euros, England fell at the final hurdle, losing in the final itself at the hands of Italy on penalties. But you look at the squad, you look at where England should be, and we're led to believe, Stuart, that this could well be England's Euros. Absolutely. I think England are a very good team. They've got a manager that has failed in the very biggest games. That's where he's got to improve. You mentioned that game against Italy in 2020. That's a game they should have won. They should have beaten France at the World Cup as well. Gareth Southgate has to get this right. England have got some great players. They should be... Bellingham! Oh, a moment of pure class! Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, here it is again, and you have to say, this is a very good volley. His technique is absolutely perfect. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Dusan Tadic. Plenty of running room in the wide position. It's a perfect challenge. And the referee sensibly allowing them to carry on, advantage with them. Walker. Bukayo Saka They're making considerable progress with the ball can he take advantage and a goal they're going to take some stopping now two in front here well as you can see he's a great talent what a run, what a goal and what a play he is Back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Milinkovic Savic. Phil Foden now. And Bellingham. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Vlahovic. Zivkovic. An awful lot of green space to run into. Kane. Jude Bellingham. Trying to open up the defence. Foden. Splendid defending. Dusan Tadic. 
Zivkovic. Chance to run at them. And to reduce the deficit. Oh, a challenge of the highest order. Has a go. Well, such a high degree of difficulty. Not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Really good challenge. Not to like about that pass. And he's made headway. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And he's fired over the corner. Well, not cleared away completely. It should be. Oh, the penalty's been given. And it's not what they had in mind. It's falling apart for them. Well, there might have been a case for a yellow card, but the referee didn't see it that way. Well, Derek, it's a foul, yes. A penalty, absolute. And a goal! He was composure personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Well, here's the replay, and the goalkeeper dives early, and that's why he goes straight down the middle. What a good penalty. Watch the goalkeeper all the way. Excellent. Vlahovic, perfect challenge. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. And that's a very good parry. Well, those stats back up what we've been watching. It's been a really one-sided game. And it's far too easy for them to open up this defence. This could turn into a rout. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Now maybe the really short route to goal. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. Well, as you'll see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the plane he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted, and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. Trippier. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Zivkovic. Could reduce the deficit. is becoming quite possible well here it is again and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post but I think he should probably do better he'll be a little bit disappointed with that and there it is the half time whistle So they get the ball rolling once more, and it's advantage England after the first half. Let's see what the second 45 has in store for us. Just the challenge that was required. Intense pressure. Foden. Oh, good vision. Foden, and a goal! They're going to take some stopping now, two in front here. Yeah, here's the set-up play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And what a good finish from Foden. He just strikes it so cleanly. It really is a well-taken goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Dusan Tadic. Gomez now. Stones. England unable to retain possession. 
How about the cross? Shaping to shoot. What a commitment to defending. Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Now the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Oh, splendid skill. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. That's a good-looking ball. Mitrovic. Could be. Well, not to be. And they need to get going in an attacking sense here. Well, in their position, this sort of chance needs to be taken. The switch of play now. Walker just couldn't keep it. Good idea. Could pull one back here. And he does! He's thrown his team a lifeline. The belief is back. Well, here's the goal again. And it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding. And when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. Well, how about this? 4-3. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. The supporters want to see him have a go. Well, the keeper in position to prevent another goal from him. Well, he's a massive threat. That really could have been his second goal there. Walker. Well, a good tackle. And England pushing forward with options available. Well, that one has promise. Mitrovic. Dusan Vlahovic. Zivkovic. Very quick thinking there. And England being afforded too much space. Not away completely. Not to be in terms of the... Milinkovic Savic, Pavlovic. Velko Birmancevic trying to open up the defence. Well, fantastic reflex action. And short it is. This could level it. Really clever pressing. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Foden. And passing it well. Tries to lift it. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, no danger now. Well, that would certainly have put them in a great position. But with only a one-goal lead, they're never going to be able to relax. Really good build-up, but no end product. And pressing from the front. Promising move this from England. But really sticking to the task defensively. Mijat Gacinovic. Nikola Milenkovic. Pavlovic. Here's Milinkovic Savic. Foden. Top class defending. Plenty of support here. On the attack in the closing phase. Timely intervention. 
Now perhaps they can counter from here. Oh, tremendous vision. Well, it broke down, alas. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Milinkovic Savic. And space to attack. Crossing possibilities. A corner then. And with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Playing it in. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Saka. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And the final whistle is sounded. England victorious. Plenty of plus points. And Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. So a positive night for Harry Kane. Sum up his performance for us. Yeah, it was certainly a good penalty. But he should have had a couple more to his name. Overall, though, I thought he had a very good game.